Today we are working on turning our pool into something like this. All right, so this is what we're dealing with. Our sock tank pool is going on year five. So we're not gonna have to do any sanding because all that galvanization is basically gone. You're taking these paper strips and laying them down so we don't get our paint or Plasti Dip onto the concrete. All right, the paper is down. Casey's putting up the umbrellas because it is hot, hot, hot outside today. Now that this is down, we're going to spray our first layer. Plasti Dip and it is a rubber coating. It's peelable. You can actually make it permanent, but we are really interested in the peelable feature. So if we decide we want to change what our pool looks like, we'll be able to peel it right off. Um, we're going to take this white color, spray everything, then we're going to let it sit for a while while we make the stencils. Um, and then when it's time, we'll come out and spray with some other fun colors. <music> I'm going to make a stencil for that leaf. So I have this plastic sheeting. I'm going to use a Sharpie and draw it out and then we're going to cut it. Here's the shape on the plastic. You cut on the inside. You don't cut nothing on the outside. That mm -hmm. out. huh. flat. I'm going to spray some of this adhesive on here. Just a light, even coat. This is backwards. Just realizing. There we go. All right, and now I am gonna let that dry for a second and then I'm gonna stick it up here. All right, this is the stencil stuck on. Pro tip, uh, make sure that your Sharpie is face up and not down because it will get Sharpie on the other side. Don't do that. Alright, 
have all the stencils on. These are actually our stickers that we sell, but I already put them on. But this is, this is it.